Do we remember when Jacob, who will become Israel, wrestled? Yes. That brother was intent. You talking about wanting what is yours? Yes. If we don't have greater commitment, than he wrestled with God. That was the Lord. All night. And the, when the angel said, look here, you got to let me go because it's about daylight. I got to go. <laughs> and dude said, not tell you, bless me. Right. I That's promise right. that you better bless me or I'm holding on. Yeah. He said, okay. <laughs> Boom, you bless and now you're going to walk with a limp. <laughs> to hear what you would have me to hear. The mouth that you would place on my face to speak the words that you would have me to speak. Amen. To uplift, to encourage, to correct. How can we love and see one another wrong and not correct? God is going to whip us with many stripes for that, sisters. And sometimes we do have issues with that because we get caught up in titles. Don't. In yeah. uh -huh. God's economy, it does not work. Yeah. He told us he is not a respected person. Okay? So, as one sister said to me, can I take a picture with you after this because you're so famous? I said, you can take a picture with me, but I promise you I am not famous. I'm in the fight just like you are. Okay? That's what we are. And, 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 and I say that not to put her in the spot to mm -hmm. Remember when uh, three Hebrew boys went into the fiery furnace? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Can you imagine? How, how many of you have ever been next to a wood burning stove? Mm -hmm. Okay. And I'm not talking about that little tin thing. I'm talking about the one that's made of iron. And when that thing get hot, even when the wood burns out. Yeah. It's still so hot you can go and you can cook on the smoke. Look here. Can you imagine the heat that was in that furnace? And they were not consumed. They didn't even get scorched. Sometimes God will put us in the thick of stuff called life. Yes. Yes. And he will let us endure battle yeah. after battle, yeah. after test, mm -hmm. after test. Mm -hmm. Why? Is it for God to know no. if I'm going to hold on, if I'm going to yield to the Holy Spirit, mm -hmm. if I've been taking the time when I had that time instead of watching the TV to sit down and read that word. Amen. If I've been in deep prayer with the Lord, right fellowship with sisters who's not going to pull me into something to talk down somebody else, but who we can sharing confidence that this is what this sister and her family are going through. Mm -hmm. And this is what we're going to pray on. Mm -hmm. This is what we're going to do. Keisha is really good for that. 
Keisha will send out a text. She will organize us. And there's a group text, and she will be specific in asking for prayer. And let's pray at this time, at this time, at this time. Now, does everybody have to be in prayer at that time? No, because you may not be. But understand that at noon, wherever sisters are that are involved in this, we're going to be praying. At three, wherever sisters are, at this time, we will be praying. Yes. And so forth and so on. And the prayers of the righteous do what? But God. And he is worthy to be what? Praise. Because he is a good good father. That's who he is. And we are loved by him. We are loved by him. And we didn't pay. He loved us first. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Yes. When you stop, when we stop, in the busyness of our minds, and we listen for the Spirit to speak, His goodness, His goodness. We remember, we recount through the Holy Spirit discernment, and we know. No matter what He permits us to go through, He has already equipped us for it. If we will but hold on, if we will but trust, if we will just. Yield. Amen. Because sometimes we get in a hurry, don't we? Yes. And we think God needs our help. Yes. And you with that golden hair, just as gorgeous as the day is long. Yes. Don't you look away. Yes. <laughs> I'm calling you out because when I get to be a big girl, I want to look like that. <laughs> you have a testimony. You know. You know. God has given you the year. You are our older, our elder sister, to sit down at the knee of another. Take a sister to lunch, an older sister to lunch, and boy, sit and talk. Or go over and take a basket, prepare a basket of something that you know she likes to eat, and get some flowers, you can get them out of the yard, you can get them at the market, wherever, and just go Amen. and show up. And you sit down and you listen. What a treasure. And all of that came from. Ooh, I missed it. Oh, I should have had you do it. You cut me off. Um, just say time. Um, you become it. The bottom line is. We're not going to live forever. And we know that death comes to the young and the old alike. But when we are fortunate enough, and I was. I, I, I was raised by my great-grandmother. My, my papa was there too, but mama was. And my grandma, my granddad was there, but my grandma. I was a fourth generation running around in the house. My grandma's first child, my cousin used to say to me, Lord, Miss Rosalie, thank the sun rises and set on you. I was like, yeah! <laughs> yeah! That's my mom! Yeah! You know, but they disappear for a short time. Take the time, sisters, to smell flowers. Take the time to not only thank the Father and praise Him, glorifying Him in every thought, every word, every deed, but take the time to glorify Him in the love 
that we share in thanksgiving for the golden haired sisters that God leaves among us because it is your wisdom your way to love the unlovable. Amen. That testifies of the goodness of God. Because all of sisters, those attributes, those characteristics of God, because we are made in his image. Guess who got them to y'all? Okay? And again, how many of you have ever been to a buffet? <laughs> I know. Now, you go in and you are really hungry. Like today. <laughs> How many of you think that if you sit where you're sitting and you say, oh Lord, I'm just so hungry. Lord, I ask you now, thank you for providing this food and this drink. Father, Father, mm -hmm. Satisfy my physical body and my spiritual self. If you don't get your tail up out that chair, do the work. Sisters, if we don't get up, if we don't get out of ourselves, if we don't understand that the tool that God has left us, the greatest tool that we will ever need to be our roadmap through this life, so that there is a certainty when we get to the other life. The reward will be tremendous. We better read. And we better read more than once. And we better not pick it up to read it until we pray and ask the Holy Spirit to clear my mind. Just like when we go to pray. Don't think the devil is afraid. He can come to church and sit down. Okay? And figure it out. Sit beside you. Sit beside you. Look, remember when he was in glory? He was right there. He was one of the few right there charged to take care of. And this brother said, and I'm going to just call him a brother. <laughs> and I ain't talking about skin color. <laughs> Until he messed up, he was good family. He messed up, he lost his inheritance. Yes. Yes. And how many of y'all know Muhammad Ali? Mm -hmm. Who he was? Thriller in Manila. <laughs> the first one was not in Manila. No rumble in the jungle. No rumble in the jungle. It was a rumble in heaven, baby. Okay? God set in order. Again, no surprise. Amen. And see, when we sit, we try to rationalize and reason. Well, why would God? It does not matter. It does not matter. Don't try to figure out God. Just take him at his word. Yes. Understand that in Psalm 147, verse 5. How great is our Lord! His power is absolute. His understanding is beyond comprehension. This attests and provides clear evidence and witness of God's sovereignty, His authority, and His rule. It just is. And if we are either going to live our lives by that fact and call it faith, or we have no faith. And without faith, huh? if y'all don't stop mumbling, yeah. yes, it's impossible to please the Father. How can we imitate, be imitators of Christ? Well, shut your mouth, get the word, hit your knees, and get busy. Fully equipping every day. Just like we go to eat and drink something every day for this physical body. If we don't eat and if we don't drink of the goodness of God through the Father, through our blessed Redeemer and Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, and through the guidance and the discernment 
of the Holy Spirit, then it's not going to work out. And you might as well go back to what you used to do. But if you're in it to win it, then sisters understand. He like no other. Oh, yes, ma'am, we got to get busy. Like no other, he will empower us. Remember the Jetsons when they could fly? Yeah. Okay, with the, the power pack. No, they, they flew in the car. Something, I can't remember now. But they had the little power pack. and they. Okay, we got the power. I got the power! Yeah! Okay, we got it. If we don't claim it, it's just there. It's just there. So, out of the hurt, the pain, the squeezing, some, and out of the joy, because see, we don't have a problem. The Lord, when the sun is shining, uh -huh. and boy, cha-ching, that direct deposit hit Friday morning, you went in that app, check, oh, thank you, Lord, got it. <laughs> okay? Yes, we ought to. Because all good things come from whom? God. That's right. Yes. But if that's all we can give him thanks and praise for, that's exactly right. Shame on us. Amen. We miss it. Yeah. We miss it. <clears throat> so I will say to you, in closing, Psalm 52, verse 9. I will praise you forever, O God, for what you have done. I will trust in your good name in the presence of your faithful people. And are we not sisters? His faithful people. Then remind one another in right fellowship. And for goodness sake, Remind yourself, God don't make no junk. Amen. Okay. Amen. So yes, you can praise the Lord all by yourself, just Amen. like I do. Amen. Okay? So sometimes we can't wait for it to come from somebody else. Sometimes when you're home washing those dishes and pushing that back and dusting, yes. Woo, yes. washing all that laundry and your back is killing you, but God, thank you yes. for the washer and dryer yes. that I don't have to go to the wash house. Yes. I don't have to drive to the laundromat. <laughs> thank you, God, his good name. We are. Say, I am, I am. Created. created in the image, in the image. Of, God. of God. And I am. And I the child, the child of a good, good father. Of a good, good father. He's a good, good father. That's who he is. That's who he is. That's who he is. And we're loved by him. That's who we are. That's who we are. That's who we are. My sisters, stay united, stay grounded, and hold on, because victory is ours. Amen.